Hello, everybody. Happy Wednesday to you. Now, I'm actually filming this on Tuesday night, right? Look, you can see the clock behind me. What does that say? 7.30? All right, so I'm at North Kansas City Hospital. It's been a fun day for me. I've got somebody to introduce you to. Well, first off, there's Mrs. McSparren. Say hello, everybody, to Reed Alexander McSparren. Hey, buddy, say hi. Oh, you're a newborn. You can't say hi yet? Okay. Look at how cute he is. So that's the little man. That's the reason I'm unfortunately not with you. All right. Let's do this. Oh, what kind of notes do we need? Well, first off, you need to know Reed Alexander McSparren. That's our new friend. He was born... Uh, let's see, born at roughly 10.45 a.m. Uh, he was 7 pounds, 8 ounces, 7 pounds, 8 ounces. He was 21 and 3 quarters inches, 20 and 3 quarters, that's right, okay. 20 and 3 quarters inches long. What else should they know about him? He's a good eater. Yeah. Eats like a champ, poops, grows sticky stuff. That's right. Mr. McSparren has got himself one reed poop diaper so far. Mm -hmm. It'll only get worse. Um, all right. So um, I've actually not heard from Coach Roach yet. I'm assuming that he is about to text me any minute with a glowing report of how good you guys were today. Um, and I appreciate that. Uh, so coming up today, here's what you guys have. So, or, wait, sorry, how good you guys were yesterday because you're watching this on Wednesday. All right. Um, so today, here's what you guys have. Um, in, this, uh, in this announcement, there's going to be a link to, uh, it's going to be called Two Springs Lab. So you're going to do the Two Springs Lab today. Um, there should be up at the front of the room. Um, boxes full of springs. You and a partner, so work in pairs, two at a time, you and a partner are going to get two of those spring scales. Um, the, the scales are pretty simple, like you pull on one end and then you can read the force on the side. Um, but you're gonna, it's going to ask you to do a couple of things. Um, it's going to ask you to measure some stuff with the spring scales and put them um, in the lab report. You'll download a document, like a lab report document. Um, you'll put your readings in there. There's going to be a couple times where it asks you to hook the spring scales together, right? So take the spring scales, you'll hook them together, and you'll pull them both at the same time, and you'll read them both at the same time, right? So like while you're pulling, you'll read this one, and then you'll also read this one at the exact same time. So two people will have to pull at the same time, all right? And then later after that, you're going to turn them and you're going to hang stuff like that, right? So you'll, you'll hang an object, like you'll hang a weight, and then you'll hook the other spring scale on, and you'll hang the weight again. And again, you're going to read both spring scales, right? Read the top one and the bottom one at the same time. Hopefully that makes, makes sense. Two spring, two spring scales, okay? Read them both at the same time. Um, there should be like this big thing you realize by the end, and it's going to be our introduction to Newton's third law. So um, at the very end, what you'll do is... There is a discussion post. So, so this thing, this link right here, this thing, is actually a link to a discussion post. Um, so when you're all done, from that link, you're going to click the reply button. Uh, so click reply and answer the question. So there's a question in that discussion post. You're going to click reply and answer it. And here's the deal. I can't be with you, so I can't talk to you guys. So um, that, that reply to the discussion post is that's how I'm going to know whether you guys got it or not, right? So I'll read those and I'll be like, oh, cool. They, they figured it out. Yay. Or I'll be like, ugh, they're, they were, they're confused. I need to do something else. So um, you guys will figure that out or you'll, you'll, you'll reply. I'll know what's going on. Again, you can email me whenever you want. Tyler McSparren at nkcschools.org. I may or may not reply, but you can certainly email me there. Um, we'll be in the hospital for another day, and then we'll go home, and eventually I'll see you guys again. All right, that's all I got. Email me if you need me. Peace. Read. Say bye. Bye, you guys. There you go.